On Monday morning, communities in the south of the United States awoke to a deadly tornado outbreak and severe thunderstorms. At least 27 tornadoes were reported over the weekend in five different states, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia, and Tennessee. In Mississippi, where one long track twister left a 59-mile-long path of devastation, authorities reported that at least 25 people died. In Alabama, where authorities reported that a man passed away from his injuries after being saved by first responders, there was at least one storm-related fatality. The southeast will experience damaging winds, large hail, and an isolated tornado threat on Monday, according to the most recent National Weather Service forecast. The cities of Columbus, Savannah, and Charleston, as well as a portion of southern Georgia and South Carolina, will fall within the bullseye. Up until Monday at 11 a.m. Eastern Time, a tornado watch for central Georgia, including the city of Macon, is in effect. Additionally, areas of Alabama and Georgia, where up to seven inches of rain have already fallen, were given flood watches and flash flood warnings. On Monday night, a new storm is expected to hit the west coast, bringing with it a lot of wind and rain along the coast, and a lot of snow in the mountains. On Tuesday morning, the San Francisco Bay Area is predicted to experience heavy rain, but gusty winds will start on Monday. Local rainfall amounts of 2 to 5 inches could fall in certain regions of Northern California. A winter storm warning has been issued by the National Weather Service for portions of the Sierra Nevada mountain range in Northern California, where 2 to 4 feet of local snowfall is forecast to fall over the next few days. On Thursday, more severe weather is expected to hit Texas and Oklahoma as this new storm system moves across the nation. On Friday, a significant outbreak of severe weather with the potential for tornadoes, damaging winds and large hail could affect regions from Texas to Wisconsin. Further north, from the Dakotas to Minnesota, Wisconsin and Michigan, a late-season winter storm may hit.